Alright, let's talk about how generative AI is changing the game for developers. Used wisely, tools like ChatGPT, Cursor AI, and V0 can seriously speed up your workflow, helping you go from idea to prototype in minutes instead of hours. Whether you're stuck writing boilerplate code, designing UI layouts, or just need a quick starting point, these tools can take a big chunk of the grunt work off your plate. But here's the thing, not all AI tools are equal. Some are better at structure, some at styling, some just look cooler on screen. So today, we're putting them to the test. We're taking three popular Gen AI tools, ChatGPT, V0, and Cursor, and giving them the exact same challenge. Create a fancy, modern landing page. It should have a smooth gradient background, stylish fonts, and some nice interactive elements like hover animations or scroll effects. And here's the catch, everything has to be written in a single HTML file. No extra style sheets, no frameworks, no imports. Just plain HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. And it has to look good. Here's the prompt we'll use for all three. Create a fancy, modern landing page with a gradient background, stylish fonts, and interactive elements like a hover animation or scroll effect. Use only HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, all in a single file. Make it visually impressive and responsive. Keep the code clean and readable. Let's start with ChatGPT, the free version. We paste in the prompt and wait a few seconds. All right, the code's coming together. Nice clean structure, solid use of CSS gradients, some hover effects, a button or two. Not bad. Let's copy that over to W3School's online HTML editor to see how it actually looks. Okay. Wow, that's actually pretty nice. Simple but clean. We've got a full page gradient, a centered title and button, and smooth transitions on hover. For a first try, that's solid. Now let's move over to V0. Same prompt, dropped in. We wait, and boom. It's generating a full layout with a live preview. That's one of V0's biggest advantages, you can see exactly what's happening as it builds. And this one? Looks super slick. The font choice is great, the animations are smooth, and the colors really pop. It's the kind of landing page you could actually show a client. Let's still copy it into W3Schools just to see how it performs outside the V0 editor, and yeah, still looks awesome. Super fancy. Alright, final test, Cursor AI. Prompts in, waiting a bit, and here comes the code. It's methodical, a bit more dev-focused, with plenty of comments and structure. You can tell Cursor is geared toward people who want to stay in the code but move faster. Let's paste it into W3Schools and hit run. And yeah, it looks good. Maybe not as flashy as V0s, but clean, functional, and interactive. So, how do they stack up? ChatGPT gave us solid structure and decent style. Cursor focused on clean, readable code with good interactivity. But V0? V0 brought the wow factor. Visuals, polish, and instant preview, all in one go. So the big question is, which one would you use? Let me know in the comments. And if you want to try it yourself, the prompt's in the description. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned, we've got more AI dev experiments coming soon.